Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on where you are in this world. This is Hajin Lee with a morning update for Bitcoin. I'm very excited. My goodness, my call yesterday, and just in time identifying this ABCDE pattern, turned out to be prescient. Boom. It broke through. The top line of this triangle was breached after the ABCDE waves were completed. Even the bulwark had a role in enabling this breach of the top line of the triangle. Now, where to next? I believe since the 13908 was breached, I'll put a check mark right there. I believe the next thing that we need to do is make higher highs. So what we need to then do is, I believe the wave two is going to be here. This is going to be some kind of a flag or a triangle or a downward pointing symmetrical triangle. <clears throat> so if this A, B, C, D, E completes, let's zoom in. We can label it as A, B, C, D, and E. And let's see how that goes for today. It may complete it, or it may just be an A, B, C, and it should continue going upwards. So what's really important here is that overall, this is wave one. We're on wave two. We can now expect wave three to reach somewhere between 2467 as the next target. Okay, so if we do this. 2647 will give the wave 3, wave 4 will decline to 18 or so, and then the target I've been saying now probably for two weeks <coughs> of 23,500 or so. Now the blue line shows the overall scheme of, of the approximate higher degree of trend that should occur. And after turn three, we'll get a correction. And remember, corrections are always healthy. Even the very scary ones are always very healthy. You need the corrections to be able to resume the original trend of the upside. And after this correction, we'll then go to, I believe, 26,000, maybe even 30,000. If that's the case, if one is in and we're working on two, I believe the, the, I can say that correction is done. And that correction finished in the form of an A, B, C, D, E, which I didn't even recognize until just yesterday early morning right few hours before the breakout. I did not even discern that ABCD pattern, even after t over 20 years of doing this. That goes to tell you that if you keep looking at the chart, discernment will come from repetitious view of the chart. <clears throat> Another good way of getting additional discernment of pattern that you may not have seen before is to start with clean charts. In other words, if you've already labeled it, remove all the labels. Do a right click on Trading View, remove all indicators and markers, and it'll clean the whole page with a clean slate 
so that you'll have to relabel everything again, which can be a pain. But the good thing is that by restarting the labeling, as you relabel, as you redraw the patterns, you get aha moments more often than not. And these aha moments can become extremely profitable. And for that reason, because they can be extremely profitable, it is well worth getting into habit of clearing out all your prior waves, all your prior markings and labels, and redoing it and trying it again. That way you get those aha moments. And quite often it's one or two of those that can make the difference between a massive profit or just a regular everyday profit. So let's see if during today the ABCDE completes and we can see a wave high or high. What we definitely need is our higher highs. So after two is complete, we need to see and go above 15,548 or so. And I believe that's the direction that we shall go. All right, thank you. <clears throat> I appreciate your views. I appreciate your upvotes. For any of you who have zero steam power and are upvoting, first of all, I am still grateful for your upvotes. And I hope my blogs are helping you as much as possible. But if you can consider adding steam power to your Steemit accounts, an upvote with just even a little bit of steam power will make a huge difference. I wouldn't otherwise ask you to do this unless I'm, if, uh, if I was not receiving downvote campaign attacks. And if you can add a little bit of steam power, I've got now 10,000 plus followers. It'll really help a lot more to help deflect these haters and the downvote campaign coordinators, these campaign managers are trying to, to make my blogs invisible by downvoting it to invisibility. So any steam power you can add and then do an upvote will make a huge difference. I'd be grateful for that. I've been blogging here with no change in the content, no change in the number of blogs, no change in the accuracy of my blogs since June of this year. I've made no changes. I've made no insults. I've only defended my blogs with my upvotes and downvoting those who are lying, outright lying. Many are telling me to take the high road. I am. Even as a child, I did not back down to a bully. I kick their asses. And I see this no different. If they are zeroing my, trying to zero out my blogs to invisibility, I will not stay down. I would like you to then take the high road and see if you can add a bit of steam power to upvote and then better deflect these downvoter campaigns. All right, I get off my soapbox. Thank you very much, as usual. And I will be putting out continuous updates based on the requests of my followers, based on them asking, can you analyze this? Can you please update that? And there will be no end or stop to it. I hope you have a good day.